hello friends so in this today's video we're gonna upgrade the our ubuntu os from the 20 to the 22 so this is my ec2 instance where i have installed the this is the ubuntu image with the 20.04 uh, os number so we're gonna upgrade it to the 22 so let's connect to this ec2 instance and execute this uh, and fire some commands so our 22 operating system 20 operating system will convert into 22 so let's click on connect and here in, here in the ssh client here is an option of example copy this example and uh, execute this command where your key pair is present so my key pair present in the downloaders folder so let's click on enter and click on s so I have successfully logged in to do this server. So let's log in as a root. Then execute first command as a apt update, which will this command update the all the packages and the repositories which is present in this server. So our upgradation is in progress. So it is done. So let's check the Ubuntu operating system version number. LSB release hyphen A. So here we will see this our current version is Ubuntu 20.04. So I have created some document for this command. I will share this all these commands in the description. So click on first command is a sudo apt upgrade. so this is this command also similar to the apt update so and the, our next command is a sudo apt dist upgrade So it, it is unpacking, preparing, and the, all this all these uh, packages are installing now. It's still in the progress. Mm -hmm. So let's wait for this apt upgrade command. It's almost ninety eight percent. It take almost five minutes for the upgradation. Yeah, here we see the done. Then execute the sudo apt dist upgrade command. So this is also done the sudo apt dist upgrade. Then we have an sudo apt add remove so this package will remove all the unnecessary packages which is present in your system so we don't have any unnecessary packages or repositories so here we get output like zero upgraded zero newly installed so then we have next command to install the core versions of this ubuntu operating system this is also done then then we have one sudo apt do release upgrade command it will check the new releases of this uh, ubuntu operating system so here we are getting this uh, message so let's reboot the system by using the reboot command so our connection is closed now just wait for the few minutes to start the server so the reboot uh, has been done and we have successful logged into the server and then login as a root and then execute the same command again sudo do release upgrade 
so now it's checking for the new ubuntu releases and this started the then click on the y for continue to the then press enter so now it's reading the packages it's updating the security patches this is the like a real time scenario so if you are facing this any kind of error and like me you need to resolve this now it's fetching the data just wait for the fetching the data now it's again access uh, now it's again asking for the continue the uh, upgradation so let's click on this and click on enter after the 20 to 30 minutes uh, now the it's done then click on the no and press enter click on ok so now it's restarting the processes so let's wait uh, for this now press enter y again and then enter we are almost done here so press y and then uh, re reboot your system so we are uh, our connection is cold now the system is in rebooting state let's check at aws console so this is my instance now it's in rebooting state so let's wait for the two or three minutes until the ec2 instance is rebooted so let's log into the server again so this is our server is and let's check the operating system sudo hyphen i then lsb hyphen r e l e a release hyphen a so now here you will see that our uh, ubuntu operating system now is 22 uh, before that uh, we have our, our ubuntu operating system is 20.04 now it's a 22 so here we have successfully upgraded our ubuntu 22 to the 22 uh, i almost spend around uh, one and a half hour for this process so it takes almost uh, you can consider almost two hours for this uh, upgradation process so if you are doing the any this activity in production system so please inform your client or and, and please confirm for the downtime for this process so we are we have we are he, done here so we i haven't skipped any any steps so please follow these steps for upgrading the your ubuntu operating system and and thank you for the watching the video bye